Hello guys, welcome to episode 3, I think, <laughs> of Sim New Craft Hardcore Mode. That's the one. <laughs> God, what an... I have tried this intro a couple of times already. First time I said Sim New Craft, uh, Sim City. <laughs> First time I said Sim City. Second time I said uh, a wizard's rule. And just now I almost tried to say uh, Sim New Craft uh, Escape to Mars, which was of course a series that I tried once and the data just kept, kept the save games kept corrupting. Anyway, uh, in between episodes I did what I said I was going to do. I uh, added, it, added in a couple of mods. Let's see, I've got the damage indicators, which is, which is one I never mentioned. I, like, I've always found that one handy. Um, trying to recall. Let me, let me jump out of here real quick and show you. Where am I going? Mods. Um, just trying to remember what's what here. Well, there's damage indicators there. Inventory tweaks, which I said I was going to add. I just got, I just got some NEI add-ons and plugins, which I'll show you what they did in a minute. Uh, Wallia harvestability, and that is Tinker's Construct uh, Iguana tweaks, basically, now. Um, I tried to get the thing I said where it shows you exactly like what you've unlocked and everything but it's not working uh, it wouldn't work I don't know why <clears throat> but let me show you my pick did level up so I said I was gonna go go ahead and get a load of cobble didn't I my pick did level up during this process uh, it it's not clumsy anymore it's it's uh, comfortable and it added a modifier it didn't add an actual modifier itself just the ability to place a modifier on it so it still it still isn't giving all the stats that I'm used to seeing and I'm not sure what's wrong there but hey uh, yeah so I've got all the stuff that we need now to give a little builder over here so let's run over here give her all her all of her stuff eh, come on I did dig up a load of coal as well um, oh yes I did look into I did look into uh, doing this again do you know what I'm just gonna place these damn beds I did look into the uh, config and oh, was it only one bed or two shouldn't it say Oh, okay, so it's not including beds and doors in the crafting. Oh, what the hell? Where's my skin? Ugh. It's not including them in the thing. And there's nothing in the configs that allows me to say, you know, do it the way you're supposed to do it. But I'm not doing, I don't need to do that, do I? Uh, we need some of these. Now, I think it was... Let's see, let's see. 49. So that's just under the stack. There we go, that'll do. Let's put these in here. What else? Uh, do torches in a minute. Three stacks worth of planks. That's easy enough. Just grab a stack of wood and. Boom, boom, boom. Six torches. Oh, you do need wooden doors. Okay, well, you got one wooden door. Why do you need two? Or maybe it's like a top half and the bottom half. You need some of these, unless I've already done it. I can't remember. I will give you a second door, and then of course we'll make up some torches for you. Wrong one, I need these and six torches. So we just need to make up eight and give you what's left there. And hopefully, you won't need anything else. <coughs> hopefully. Now, we can't dig up, I've been looking around, we can't dig up any iron whatsoever um, at the moment not with any of our tool levels so I want to see I want to double check I do think this is, this is nuggets 
Um, but if that's the case, we're going to have to go mining. We can harvest aluminium and copper. Oh no, it's one per. Ooh, that's pretty good. All right, well I'm going to take that out of there then. Because what we're going to need to do... What the hell is going on here? What the hell? Get out of the way, woman. In the way. Uh, fire you. Let's start this afresh. No wool starter home. Now hopefully she'll take up the stuff and just replace it. Hopefully it'll actually get done properly. There we go, now she's building. Even the door went on, fantastic. Okay, oh yes, 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 I know what that is all about. All right, so anyway, we can leave her to that for now and let's actually go and get some mining done. Um, I do need to go and drop off all the excess stuff I've got. How many glass panes is it you need? Just want to make sure you've got enough. 20. Uh, and you need some more torches. Yay. Thank you for wasting our torches. Take them. And we'll just make you up some more panes. There. Let's go back over here. I do want to set something up, um, <clears throat> set something going, uh, while, for, to, to cook up while we're melting, while we're melting, while we're mining. Uh, we are going to need a smelter ring, uh, especially it's going to be crucial like this early on. And um, what it's going to do is double our ores. Here, let me show you. Mm. Just quickly, there's some iron here. This is what one of the plugins do. As you can see, uh, it tells us we've got the, if we've got the correct tool and if we've got the correct harvest level. Now we have the correct tool, we can't actually harvest it, which is unfortunate. But I thought I'd show you that. That was one of the things that I added in. All right guys, well I'm gonna go back to the house. I'm gonna empty off my inventory and sleep for the night. And I'll see you guys in just a moment. All right guys, we're back. I've cleaned out my inventory. Apart from that, <laughs> um, we, I do realise, did re I have just realised that before we go ahead and uh, go mining, I am going to have to go get some more sand here. Uh, reason being is we're going to need it to make some. I need to remember these names. I really, really do. Seared brick, or oh, grout in this case, to make seared brick. That only gives us 56, and we're going to need a little bit more than that. So. What that was, was clay, uh, four, let me, let me show you the two recipes, it'll be easier this way. You can either do it one clay ball, one gravel, one sand, gives you two. Or, if you do it this way, it uses up the same amount and doubles, yeah, so it's still the same amount, it just does it in a larger quantity. Uh, four and four with a clay block and it's it's no specific place you can have sand 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 and the rest in gravel you know it doesn't matter where you put them it's shapeless so for now I'm gonna go ahead and start cooking the grout that we've already got and we're just gonna quickly go and get some more sand that way we can get a load of this cooking whilst we mine it will save a lot of time uh, for all of us really that's copper isn't it we're gonna need this see the reason why I want to get a smeltery is we're gonna need metals it doubles your ores as I say but it also allows you to uh, make metal tool parts because we're gonna need to upgrade our place was well, it almost is finished it your birthday next week? no uh, a few months too early I'm afraid not till November we're just about finished here as well. 
going to let her finish up real quick. Okay, maybe not real quick. We'll come back to that in a bit. <laughs> Let's go find some sand. Alright guys, well I've got a load of sand here. I've got, I've got just over a stack and a half. Um, also picked up a tiny bit extra clay here, just in case. Um, while I was over here, of course the house went ahead and finished. We thought it would. What do you mean group all selected? I pushed the wrong button. What does it do? Um, <laughs> She finished move, uh, building the house and moved straight in, and then Primrose Dimplehorn uh, decided to join us. So, welcome Primrose. In fact, is that you over there? It is. Hey Primrose. Um, I know you can't really see me properly, but I'm over here. You're a blind elf, apparently. Okay. Unexpected. I've never seen these skins. I really haven't. Um, it must be uh, must be the the uh, an update to this mod pack uh, mod pack to this texture pack that I've never seen before. Well, we were over here. Come on and back. Right. I wonder if this works still. No. Okay. Oh no, might be, might do. It just, uh, yeah, it does still work. Basically, with um, inventory tweaks, you can hold Shift, then W for up or S for down, and click, and it will go either up, and then up would be back down, back onto here, and then up here, or down to go the other direction. It's quite a handy little tool to have, but it doesn't like work like working with these tables. I remem remember that now. Right, let's go ahead and do as much of this as we can. Gonna get another couple of tables going. Oh, right, tables. Um, furnace. Don't know what's going on with me today. Plop, plop. Need some more coal. Thank you. When we get back, we can make a start on that. Um, pop this in there. Let's get some preparations set up. Um, let's take a stack of actual wood. We are going to need to take some gravel with us. Make up some pl uh, initial torches. Right, let's get going. Now there are there is going to be quite a bit of stuff that we cannot uh, mine up ourselves. Purely uh, because we haven't got the hardware for it. I was going to say technology then. No, no, we don't have the hardware to mine quite a bit of the stuff that we're going to want. Um, so I'm trying to figure out whether we should just jump down into here. <coughs> Yeah. Let's not say we did. <laughs> Alright, let's start our own little mine. Right over here in this corner, I think. Or, we could go into here. But it's bedtime first. I am not going to start this off with mobs jumping at me from behind. You know, just trying to light the way, mine up everything, and then get attacked because everyone's just piled into the the uh, <laughs> into the mine from behind. No, thank you. Right now, where were we? It was over in this direction somewhere. Hey, hey we oh, that the thing lied to me. It says we're meant to get five credits a day, but we actually only got uh, two point seven five. I think that was 2.75. Yeah. It's a bit of a con, isn't it? Where is this hole? I've lost it. Not good. I place a torch down and everything. Why? 
I thought that was a dog then. Seriously, where the... Ah, here it is. <laughs> I really should mark this so I can see it. Ah, another good feature. Yes. This is with the... NEI. F7, if it's yellow, it means it has the potential to spawn when it gets dark enough. Spawn mobs when it's dark enough. If it's red, it means they have to, uh, it's dark enough for them to spawn now. Right, well, I think we are okay. okay. We've kind of reached the end. Um, not that far, obviously, underground, but it's better than nothing. That minimap really is quite big, isn't it? Oh, well, it's easy to look at. So I'm going to do some mining here, guys. I'm going to... You know what, I'm not going to actually now. I was going to cut away and come back, but um, I'm not gonna, actually going to go that far. I've got no reason to go that far. We're just kind of gathering a few little resources while we wait uh, for the smeltery stuff to cook up. Although, we are going to need lava. We are going to need some lava. Um, Right. I know what we can. Do. I know what we can do here. I got an idea. Eh. Now I'd need to double check in the ravine, but even if it doesn't have any lava in there, I think we can do this. Let's turn this off because it does cause some FPS issues. Let's go check out the, the ravine real, real quick. What am I doing it like this for? Well, I can just go ahead and check it on here. No, no lava. <coughs> uh, it's a shame there's no surface lava either. That's fine, it's not a problem. Um, and we can't create buckets yet either, unless... No, it's only iron. We can't use uh, aluminum to do it, or aluminium, whatever! <laughs> aluminium, aluminium, who's, whoever it belongs to, it doesn't matter. Uh, what we can do, oh cool, is, we need some clay. At least I think we got this in here, we should do. Give me the damn thing. One, two, three, an unfired clay bucket. We'll go ahead and cook this up. Now this is awesome. It's a good little starter thing here. What it'll do... Actually, no, we need that in the wood, don't we? What it does is... It will... Um, contain, it will hot, you can use it as many times as you want with water. But if you use it for... Lava, it's a one use only. Out of interest... Do we have pyrothium in here? I don't know if that's um, on... Okay, no, it isn't. <laughs> See, I know that you can use the smelteries to make liquid pyrothium, and that burns a lot hotter and a lot faster, but no need. While we're over here, I want to... No, it's not that one, is it? It's this one I want. Rotate stairs. There we go, all the torches are in the right place. Just need to fix the bed here. And we're set. Um, I've just seen the time, guys. We're kind of. I'm, as I'm trying to keep it at 20 minute videos, we are kind of running over a little bit now. So I am going to have to end off here. Next episode, we will definitely be creating the smeltery and going down and get some lava too. Sorry, this one's kind of been a bit all over the place. But it happens from time to time. You know, we're just getting started. We're trying to get multiple different tasks done simultaneously. Uh, and it's, it's... Multitasking is one thing, but multitasking in multiple different areas is a little harder. So, I want to thank you guys for watching. Um, I'm just going to let these cook up in between episodes and the rest of the grout that we've got in there. Just so it's done and out of the way. And I hope to see you guys on the next episode. Please don't forget to rate and comment below. And I'll see you next time. Thanks guys, bye.